There are many ways to honor or pay tribute to a special experience or harvest or hunt, uh, such as with a beautiful set of antlers. Another of my favorite things to do is to make a pendant out of an elk ivory, uh, like this one that I'm wearing right now. Now, elk ivories, to me and to a lot of uh, high country people, carry a special significance. They bring memories of bugling bull elk, the scent of pines in the high country, and of wild, deep backcountry experiences. So today I want to show you how to take an elk ivory and turn it into a pendant like this. So here's what you're going to need to make your elk ivory pendant. Obviously, you're going to need to start off with an elk ivory. You're going to need two drill bits, 1 16th and 1 8th in size. You're going to need a little 5 8 inch long antler tine tip. And you're going to need some string, wax nylon string, artificial sinew, or a piece of brain tan buckskin if you can find it. First step, drill a hole on each side of your tooth at the base of the root, top of the tooth, with your 1 16th inch drill bit. Come behind with your 1 8th inch drill bit and chamfer the holes so they don't cut your string. Thread a piece of string through and tie it off, or if you wish, twist it into a piece of cordage. Tie one end of your cordage off in a bowline loop. In the other end, thread it through a hole drilled in your 1 8 inch antler tine tip. Burn the end off so it can't come back through. And that leaves you with an elk ivory pendant with a great little antler tip closure for the back. 